Hello, friends. Today we'll learn about hot and cold. You're sitting here and enjoying yummy dumplings. Be careful, buddy. This is steaming hot. Have you ever noticed how you sense whether something is hot or cold? There are three layers in the skin: epidermis, dermis, and the hypodermis. Look closely. Thermoreceptors are present in the dermis layer. Thermoreceptor neurons relay temperature signals to projection neurons in the brain. Cold projection neurons are directly activated by cold thermoreceptor neurons, and hot projection neurons are activated by hot thermoreceptor neurons. Apart from the senses of hot and cold, sometimes your body also feels hot or cold flashes. Remember, once your friend started to get cold flashes, he started to shake and turned a bit pale. People can experience chills without a fever for many reasons. Anemia. It's a condition often caused by not having enough iron in your blood. Iron deficient individuals often feel cold. Especially on their feet and hands. Hypothyroidism. People with hypothyroidism suffer from colds because they do not produce enough thyroid hormone to convert and utilize stored energy effectively. Raynaud's syndrome. In this condition, the sensitive blood vessels overreact to cold temperatures and become narrower than usual, significantly restricting the blood flow. Anorexia. It's an eating disorder in which the body temperature and basal metabolic rate drop, causing the hands to be extremely cold. Ah, you're sweating so much. Sweating more or feeling hotter than usual can be due to various reasons. Hypothyroidism. An overactive thyroid can cause you to feel hot. When the body processes too many hormones. It can affect the regulatory system and cause you to overheat. Stress and anxiety. The body releases stress hormones that send blood to the muscles and increase circulation, which can contribute to feeling hot. Heavy caffeine. If you consume too much caffeine, it may increase your blood pressure, resulting in excess sweating. Being overweight. Fat. Acts as an insulator. People with excess fat may feel hotter, sweat more profusely, and take longer to cool down. Here are some easy remedies when you suddenly feel hot or cold. Add layers during a cold flash to help you feel more comfortable. If you've had a hot flash, change wet clothing or bedding immediately. Drink plenty of fluids because they replace lost electrolytes through sweat. Try yoga, meditation, deep breathing, or other things you find relaxing. Feeling hot or cold all the time may be an indicator that there's an underlying health issue. It's best to schedule an appointment with your doctor. Now you know a lot about the topic. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye bye.